I want to take a few moments to give you some tips on how to maximize your battery life while using your Windows 10 device. One of the biggest things you can do right off the bat is adjust the power mode that your device is operating in. Click on the battery icon in the taskbar in the lower right corner, and you'll see a few different power mode options. Right now, mine is on best performance, which as the name implies, gives you the best performance you can get out of your device, but at the expense of battery life. You can drag the slider to adjust this, the next option being better performance. This still favors performance over your battery, but not as drastically. Better battery is the next option, which you may find in some cases to already be the default setting for when running on battery. This delivers longer battery life at the expense of some performance, but in cases when you're primarily focused on getting longer battery life out of your device, this is a very good option. The last option, Battery Saver, disables some Windows features completely and throttles others, and also reduces the screen brightness. This is typically something you might use if your battery percentage gets low and you want to squeeze as much time out of your device as possible. You can also adjust your screen brightness manually by clicking this icon at the bottom of the window. The brighter you have your screen set, the more battery it's going to use. Click Battery Settings to bring up the Settings window. Right at the top, you can see how much battery life you have left. And if you click See which apps are affecting battery life, then you'll get a list of the apps that are consuming most of your battery. You can change the time period, if you want a longer or shorter view of this, and also change which apps are shown. If you still have apps open that you're not actively using, it may be a good idea to close them until you need them again. Within this window, you can also click on an app and adjust whether you want Windows to decide whether it can run in the background when you're not actively using it. If you uncheck this option, then you can decide manually how you want an app to behave. In most cases, you would just let Windows take care of this. Back on the Battery Settings window, if you scroll down a bit, you'll see some settings related to the Battery Saver Performance mode I mentioned earlier. By default, it'll turn on automatically when your battery reaches 20%, but you can use this slider to change that to a different percentage if you want to. You can also turn it on immediately, until the next time that your device is plugged into charge. And you can also stop it from lowering your screen's brightness if you prefer to keep it at your own manual setting. If you click the link at the bottom of the window, you'll also find some options to adjust how the built-in Windows video platform affects battery life. Scroll down to the bottom and you'll see an option for whether video playback should be optimized for battery life or video quality. And you can also check this box to have Windows automatically lower the resolution of a video when your device is on battery. If you go back to the home screen of the Windows Settings window, and then to Devices, you can also disable Bluetooth if you don't need it, which may save you just a bit of battery. And one of the last big things you can do to help save battery life is to simply not leave the device running when you don't need it. Click the Start button, then click the Power button, and click Sleep. This puts your device in a low power state, but your apps stay open. When you wake the computer back up, you're right back where you left off. If you have any other questions, you can always visit the Acer community or our Acer support site.